morning. How are you? I'm doing well, thanks. You got revenge on X now. <laughs> I used his Jersey Mike's points to get a free sandwich. Listen, girl. Oh, savage. Listen, girl. <laughs> Absolutely. No, it's right. totally worth it. He definitely deserved more than that, but I was just like, this is enough for me. This feels good. Because it was a whole free sandwich, you know? Hell yeah, girl. Oh, God, Hell yeah. The game. All right. Kelsey, can I put you holes That's one second? Awesome. Yeah. One thanks. second. No problem. That. that- Hilarious. That's brilliant. That's now, really funny. I that's like that. one end of the spectrum. Mm-hmm. Let me go. Fake name Amanda. Fake, fake name Amanda. Good morning. Oh, no. Fake name Amanda. There, there we go. There we go. No, no, no. I'm sorry. Good morning. Good morning. All right, girl. Morning. How'd you get revenge on X? So he was constantly always um, cheating on me and stuff. Like, he would drop me off at home and whatever. So in order for me to, like, get revenge on him, I stubbed his curtain rods with shrimp skin, and he couldn't uh, figure it out what the smell was or where it came from. Ew. To the That's point annoying. where it even ran him out of the apartment. That's that, hilarious that and is. super gross, but I yes. love that. Now, Amanda, how'd you get the idea to stuff the curtain rods? Um, That's a very peculiar uh, question, because um, I was, I was thinking of ways like he really couldn't find it, yeah. So that's why I was like, maybe inside the curtain rod, sure. you really won't be able to find no, it. I'm oh, putting yeah. it with him wherever he moves. You would oh, never it's so, look yeah. there, ever. Yeah, that, I'm putting that in my back pocket. Fake name Amanda, one second. You were in the uh, running. Let me go. Hold on. Do, 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 do. There's somebody. in Frederick, Chelsea, good morning. Hi, good morning. So you were dating this person for how long, Chelsea? So I dated this person, honestly, for 10 years. Okay. Oh, my God. Broke up, obviously. Which is... Which is which is why I moved to Frederick. Sure, okay. absolutely. But, so constant red flags. I knew he was stepping out. So he broke up with me on the Thursday. I'll never forget it. I knew he had a dentist appointment because he chipped his front left tooth. Yeah. On a on something, and I knew he had an appointment coming up that Monday or Tuesday. So I called, pretending to still be his girlfriend, and said, "Oh, he's sick and couldn't make it. <sighs> he had to wait a whole another three and a half weeks with a chipped front tooth going to work." Oh, oh my god! god. That's I'm like, so good. I'm like, I'm like, this story will come in handy one day. Absolutely, I love that. no, that's amazing kind and, and deservedly so. Yeah, All right, yeah. Chelsea, one second, you were in the running. That to me, brilliant. Let I love that. Go. Uh, Gabby, good morning. Good morning. Right, you, you were dating this man for how long, Gabby? Uh, about two and a half years. Okay, we broke up, and you got revenge how? Um, I walked in on him with him and the other girl, so I slept with both of his best friends. Okay. With both of his best friends? Both of them. At the same time? or? No, not at the same time, but what was in like within like a three-week span. I was going to say, so you, you, you walked oh. in, horrendous. How soon before we hooked up with the first friend? Um, Probably like... Two weeks. Okay. And did you tell the friend, hey, listen, this is what happened. This is what I want to do. Or it just kind of happened organically. We were, like, we're, we were like all in the same friend groups. They all knew like from yeah. everyone yeah. else. Yeah. Yeah. But like, did you just say to that friend, hey, listen, let's get revenge? Um, Like not then, but like we've talked like after like years later and we were like, yeah, that was why we, that, we did yeah. that. And he was like, yeah, I didn't like him either. Okay. <laughs> oh my God. Gabby, one second. You're in the running. It. That is one of those ones too where that will mess with the dude for life. Yeah. For, like, oh, my friends? Absolutely. Yeah. And the, I mean, yeah, the buddy's like, yeah, that was a dumb thing to do. Yeah, you're absolutely. stupid. Mm-hmm. Uh, let me go. <laughs> Brandy, good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing well, thank you. This person was who to you? So this is one of my best friends. She lives in the Carolinas right now. She was dating this guy for a few weeks or something, and she found out he was talking to girls on Snapchat. So she kicked him out, and then she bought a bunch of fake keys online, and she's been putting those little tags on them where you can, like, write people's names and stuff on them. Yeah. So she's been writing his name and phone number on the tags and just leaving them in random places around town. (laughs) So people have been calling him saying, hey, I found your lost keys. And he's been like, I have no clue what these people are talking about. That is hilarious. left like 15 keys so far. So who knows how many people have called him, but it makes her feel good and it makes us laugh. Oh, yeah. That's brilliant. I love that. Okay. Brandy, one second. You're in the running. Yeah, because then people are for sure going to probably call, leave a voicemail, yeah. leave another voicemail, and like be very concerned. Do you want your key back or not? Yeah, <laughs> right? that, okay. Um, like, gosh, let me go, hold on. Fake name Melissa needs voice change. 
in beautiful Sterling. Fake name Melissa. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Doing well, thank you. This person, uh, we were dating him for how long? I was dating him for about three years. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then we break up. You decide to get revenge how, girlfriend? I brought a date intentionally to the restaurant that I knew him and his family were going to be dining at that night. Okay, pause. Now, how did you know his family was going to be at this restaurant? Because we were only had broken up like two weeks prior, and I was supposed to go to that dinner because his sister was in town. Oh, oh okay. And so when you showed up, so I made it so we sat in a booth by the. Um, I made it so we got there like a little early and sat in a booth by the front door so he would see us. Okay, okay and when brilliant. he saw you, what happened? He flipped shit. Nope. He, oh, he, no, no, he no. That. He lost he flipped, his mind. Oh, yep, he lost he, his mind. He flipped, yes. Lost his mind. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. I'm assuming yeah. we're not back together. <laughs> Hell no. Okay. No, no. What restaurant was yeah. it? Uncle Julio's. Oh, nice. You okay. Get that table side guac. Nice. Or no, no, I don't like guacamole. Oh. Oh, okay, fair enough. Yeah, All right. Fade name Melissa. One second. There we go. <laughs> get those when they mix them together. Yeah. The swirl marks. Oh, man. That's dangerous. Mm-hmm. Let's go. Uh, fake name George. Good morning. Hey, good morning. All right. This person was who to you? Fake name George. He was my fiance. We were uh, together for two and a half years about. Okay, two mm-hmm. and a half years, and you got revenge. How? Well, uh, at the end, it was going. It was getting bad. So uh, she tried to get me fired from my job. Mm-hmm. So uh, after we broke up, I ended up uh, hooking up with her sister. Oh nice. My God. Oh. Okay. Older or younger? Stay in the fam. She was. Uh, she was younger. She was about like seven years younger. Okay. And so, oh uh, who reached out to who first? Um, me and the sister continued talking. We were still sort of friends, and uh, friends. afterwards, the sister admitted to me that she want, she wished I had, I ended up uh, dating her instead of her sister. And you were like, oh. "Well, we can make that happen," and then just swung for a different branch in the family yeah, tree. Just, yeah, we just got together for a couple of times, and ended up, you know, and then stopped talking after a while. Yeah, and mm-hmm. then uh, who was more fun? It was hard to say. <laughs> no, it's oh, not God. fake name, George. No. You're among friends here. Who is more fun? You have a fake name. It's fine. <laughs> the sister. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, usually, usually how it goes. All right. Have you? Does the ex know or no? Um, that I think she found out later on, but I don't know. I oh, man. That's one of those not ones your problem. where I'd want to be there. Do you know what I mean? Fake name, George. I wish I was Yeah. I wish I was there. <laughs> oh, absolutely, dude. Hold on one second. You're in the running. Like, that's one of those ones where... I'd want to see the reaction. Oh, for sure. Like, excuse uh, me, my just, ex? Just smile. Just be like, you see, like the Zac Efron shrugging meme? Like, I, like, I don't know. Oh. I know mm-hmm. she would want him. You can uh, vote for your favorite over text, 99338. Hold on. Let me go. Uh, Lindsay, good morning. Good morning. All right. So this person was who to you? How long were you guys together for? So we were dating for about three years and worked on the same job site. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, we had a... So there was an iPad that was attached to his phone, so I found out that he had made plans for this weekend getaway. Uh, so I went and took his wallet and misplaced it for the weekend, so I knew that he, would have, he wouldn't have a bank card or a license. So That's hilarious. So you ruined his trip. Pretty smart. <laughs> Yeah, that's yep. fair. I ruined his trip and this place. So I put the wallet back in his trailer at work. So, <laughs> oh okay. my god! Fair. All right, Lindsay Hall. One second, you're in the running. Uh, somebody texted nine nine three three eight. This wasn't me, but I was at a bachelorette party weekend in Ocean City. There was some girl passing around neon green wristbands with her ex's phone number on it. <gasps> Oh, my God. So, of course, we gr- I'll grab one, and, and one of the girls in our group signed the guy's number up for a year subscription to Cat Fact Text. No! Yes. Yes. I did that to a guy that I didn't do the Cat Fact te- Text. Uh, it was a guy I, like, briefly dated. I got him with spam emails, like, constantly, <gasps> and, oh, like, yes. spam oh physical mail to his house. What was that? Do you remember, like, the categories he used? Um, You could just, like, you can like, literally easily Google it. And then yeah. I was, like, first I did the spam emails. I was, like, Emails you can easily like opt sure. out of. I was like, I'm gonna do it for his house. Oh hell yeah! That so is... I did. So wow. to this day, I hope he's still getting those. As he <laughs> should. Somebody texted they use the phone number at the gas station to use their fuel points. Oh, that's I right. didn't okay. think about that kind of stuff. I use my mom, so I should stop do you... doing that. <laughs> yeah, poor lady. Uh, she's, a, she's a nice, nice lady. She's she's okay.